the 10th ounce American Gold Eagle coin. Because it's the smallest of all the American Gold Eagle coins, the 1 10th ounce Gold Eagle is arguably the easiest way for many people to enjoy all the benefits of investing in gold. But is it the best denomination to buy? Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching Yankee Stacking. You know, I get a lot of questions asking if the 10th ounce American Gold Eagle is the way to go when stacking gold. I mean, they say they are cheaper, right Yankee? <laughs> well, yes and no. I personally don't think you should be buying 1 10th ounce gold coins. Mm -mm. Of course, it's better than not having any gold, in my opinion, but I think as a rule, you should avoid them. Why? Well, besides the fact that they're really hard to read, I mean, yeah, you can read that, right? <laughs> Yankee's getting kind of old with the eyes here, so bear with me. Sorry if I, uh, <laughs> if you have no problem reading that, I'm going to get the lighting right. There we go. In fact, I'm going to shine better lighting on it. There, that's better. Ooh. It is pretty, but it's also pretty hard to read. <laughs> so besides that fact, it's the premiums. People, check out one of my favorite online bullion dealers, JM Bullion. So a 10th ounce gold eagle is going for $232.25 at the time of this recording, which was on Monday. Of course, they're out of stock, <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> good luck getting one, I guess. Um, the spot at this moment, too, was uh, $1,937.61. So that's $38.49 over spot, or close to a 20% premium. Ouch! That is ridiculously high, guys. Now... You can get a quarter ounce maple leaf like these for $524.41. That's about $40 over spot. But that is a premium of 9%. That's less than half the premium of the one tenth ounce American Gold Eagles. So, see. I, I, I tell people all the time, if you buy two quarter ounce uh, maples, say, or a quarter ounce American Gold Eagles, which is a half a troy ounce, okay? So two quarter ounce instead of one, two, three, four, five American Gold Eagles, one tenth ounce American Gold Eagles, you would save roughly $112 in premiums. Five of these versus two of these. Okay, and and if you go uh, to an ounce, if you did, you know, 10 of these versus four of these quarter ounces, that's twice that. It's roughly $224 of wasted premiums for an ounce, just by going from one tenth ounce to one quarter ounce. That's why I say the quarter ounce is the sweet spot, in my opinion, for fractional. Yes, a half ounce is pretty good too, but I do like the smaller, it's, it's just between that half ounce and the tenth ounce American uh, Gold Eagle or Maple Leaf. Now, of course, you're gonna pay more for the larger quarter ounce denomination, okay? but a quarter ounce maple leaf or an American gold eagle is so much easier to see. <laughs> and in my book, it's fractional enough. Okay, actually, I think it's a great fractional denomination. And obviously, if, if you can go for a full ounce of gold, you pay the least amount of premium. But, but that is a major chunk of change. It's a big investment move that, you know, it's out of the reach of, of, of a lot of people. So fractional gold is a 
is a great way to go. It's one of the three uh, methods of stacking the Yankee way, and I highly recommend you look at fractional gold, but check out a quarter ounce. Again, that's my sweet spot for stacking gold. So you might be wondering, uh, Yankee, <laughs> after all that you just said, why did you buy these one-tenth ounce American Gold Eagles? Short answer, it was just a deal I couldn't pass up. I dropped an Instagram post about a week ago on this, but you know, someone in our community reached out to me and, well, I'm waiting here at a Hannaford's public place to meet up with someone that I've met up with before who sold me some silver. Uh, just one of the incredible people in our community that uh, just you know really enjoys uh, supporting my channel and uh, helping me out. So the deal was great and uh, I said, okay, fine. <laughs> so the weight of a one-tenth ounce American Gold Eagle is 0 0.1091 troy ounces or 3.393 grams so i will definitely weigh these out and make sure that they are legit all right so yeah it, it sometimes this thing fluctuates it's kind of funny but i don't know if it's because there we go boom there it is one 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 very close i tested them all they all seem to be extremely close to that weight. They are beautiful. Look at this, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, I know I don't normally get uh, a tenth ounce, right? But because I, the, you know, usually the premiums are extremely high, you give me a great deal, and I really appreciate yeah, this I appreciate very much. I appreciate you being able to do this quickly. Really so, quick. Yep, that's that the means a lot to me. Advantage of private sale. You got it, man. Yep. <laughs> all right. Let me. Uh, work over the fiat definitely make sure that that's correct definitely. take your time count it it's it, when i saw gold uh when i first got them i yep. just fell in love <laughs> it's it's just i don't blame you man yes it, it, gold there's nothing like gold Absolutely. thanks so much for no hey this. i appreciate it and right. this it all counted up all right take care this guy sold me these american 10th ounce gold eagles for a hundred and eighty dollars each spot at the time was around 1900 bucks so that was ten dollars or six percent under spot <laughs> i had to do it i mean sometimes you just have to be opportunistic right and this was well an amazing opportunity for me so i definitely broke my uh my own rule, <laughs> this was the exception, if you will, to the rule, and I got them under spot. All right, if you get a deal like that, you just buy your gold, okay? So wh what does this mean now? So I've got these seven 10th ounce American Gold Eagle. What am I gonna do with them? Well, as you probably know, if you follow my channel, I am driving for the finish line <laughs> with the Maple Musket. Oh, yeah. I'm going to be back out here. Right there. Maple musket. <laughs> That's a tube of Canadian maple leaves. Quarter ounce. And I have 17 of them. 16, 17. <laughs> well, actually, uh, 18. <laughs> Thanks, Tim. I really appreciate you helping me get another. Actually, let me let me just drop this one right in a waiting capsule. Some people ask me, Yankee, why do you capsule your 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 maples? I mean, you don't do that with your your Yankee Cannon. Well, uh, American Gold Eagles are 22 karat gold. They are 91.6% fine. Yes, they have a full one ounce of pure gold in them, troy ounce of gold, right? So they weigh a little bit more than an ounce total, right? So again, 22 carat, has some copper in there, makes it a little bit more, you know, uh, 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 resistant to dings and that type of thing. I, I don't usually capsule encapsulate uh, 
my American Gold Eagles. But Maples, that's a whole different story. They're 24 karat gold. That is 99.99% pure. That's four nines fine for these, all right? So, and, they, and you can tell too, when you actually look at the color, you will see a difference in the way they look. This has a little bit more of a copper tone to it. I love American Gold Eagles, don't get me wrong. It's again, a full ounce of gold in a one troy ounce American Gold Eagle. But, you know, it's just, it's just that I'm stacking maples. <laughs> I have to get, I gotta get this tube done, right? So this is the thought. What if I take, uh, you know, one, two, three, four of these one-tenth ounce gold eagles and exchange them for two more maples? That brings me to a total of 20. And I think I'm going to be done at 20. I mean, seriously, the uh, Yankee Cannon's got 20. I think the Musket's going to have 20. <laughs> so we're going to stop at 20. If I can get two maples for four of these little babies, I may have to add a little bit of fiat to make that happen, but I shouldn't have to exchange five. Nope. I should only have to do four, maybe with a little bit of cash because of the premiums. So I'm, I'm looking forward to doing that. I think that's a, a good exchange. And so that leaves three left, right? Well, I wanna keep two just for, for fun and for my videos. You know, I might, I might need a 10th ounce for some future video. You know what I think I'm gonna do with this last one? I think I just might have to bless somebody else in our community with this. Come on, get I got a great deal on all seven. And I just think it's the right thing to do. Please, you know, like, comment, uh, subscribe. Oh, and check out the description of my videos. There's a lot of linkable goodies to be found in there. And as always, I hope your day is a-okay.